opinion on National Socialism in America. I would like to try it. Um, but the problem is society as a whole moves slowly. Like what I was talking about with capitalism, like for every rich man, there has to be a poor man. And like somebody stated that, you know, there's more rich people now than ever was before. There's also more poor people now than there ever were before. Not counting like slaves, like people that make choices on their own free will. Um, because like the poor, the poverty stricken people of our world have been sucked to the, sucked to the bone. And now the middle class is kind of getting it. Whereas the middle class used to be the happy medium, the cushion of society. Now they're getting taxed out of their ass and you have more people in the middle class not buying their houses but living with other people in their houses and slowly becoming the working poor as well. There aren't many people in your situation that would be so stubborn as to turn down something no. like this. No, it's I don't know of anyone who has tens of thousands of people rooting for him who can sit there and say yeah well opening a yogurt is just too much effort <laughs> i don't like yogurt i don't like it and maybe no, you're wait, picking wait, on it i don't backwards. like it either you've got tens of thousands of people cheering you on what am i doing for mother's day not a damn thing lol mother's day is special sure you buy her something then nah, i probably won't even talk to my mother on mother's day are you going to get a present for Gangsta Grandma tomorrow? Probably not, dude. There's always reasons to save money. So, like, why would I throw money away buying her flowers? So, we got the Kittens and Caboodles tapes. And during the Kittens and Caboodles tapes, they talk about how a cat always lands on their feet. And I wanted to test this out. So, what I did is I went outside and there was, uh, there was a cat. It was on a picnic table. So, I pushed the cat off the picnic table. Keep in mind, this is the smaller cat. This is a kitten, like a wild cat. It went and had kittens. So I pushed it off the table and it kind of flipped around and it landed on its feet. I'm like, wow, cool, it lands on its feet. A different cat comes along and I'm basically trying to instill dominance over the kittens in our yard. You know, this cat comes along and we had these five gallon buckets. So I took a five gallon bucket and I was like, boop. And um, I basically, I, I left the bucket on top of him because the cat couldn't move the bucket. And he, uh, he ended up dying under there. 